Kind of coming up to the ground. Nearly every night. Oh, we are doing a sea turtle. After schoolwork is done and the weather cools. I'm just chugging along. Magic starts to happen on the sidewalks of Northwest Fort Worth. I'm Jan Riggins, mom. I'm Olivia Riggins, daughter. <laughs> This delightful duo are sidewalk chalk artists who love to compete whenever they can. But the pandemic, of course, curtailed those competitions and left them itching to draw. Well, I thought, well, you know what? I have I have a driveway and I have a sidewalk and I've got the pastels. <laughs> I can just go outside. They started with a koi. And people really, really liked it in our neighborhood. So yeah. we just kept going. And it quickly grew from there. We did a, an orca. She did a um, jellyfish, butterfly couple of frogs, a bumblebee, not a bumblebee, a regular bee, a baby Yoda. The incredibly lifelike drawings caught neighbors' eyes and even caught the attention of BuzzFeed, featuring them in a piece about sidewalk art. Very surprised. I think it's fun to do, um, and I didn't really think it was going to get this sort of attention. Hey, see where it says photo time? Now it's a nightly ritual for families to stop by on walks and check out the latest masterpieces like this sea turtle. Everybody <laughs> seems to enjoy having something to look forward to and come cool. by and see. <laughs> and an opportunity for mother and daughter to bond. Not bad that a thir 13 year old still is out there doing something with her mom. I'm pretty excited. <laughs> Sharing their love and talent for art at a time when we need it most. I'm gonna do greens and blues. That would be cool. In Fort Worth, I'm Lawrence Akalik.